The name is Big Boy, Daddy Fat Sax, the nigga that like them Cadillacs. I stay down with these streets, cause these streets is where my folks at. Better know that, some say we pro black. Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Gorilla Frilla. Um, ah, damn, this sucks, cause I just did this commentary, but my dad was fucking with my computer, and now, I don't know, my mic wasn't even turned on for some reason. So I gotta redo it. I played it back, and there was nothing, and um, that was like a forehead smashing keyboard moment. Um, it's very frustrating because I hate redoing commentaries because I don't want to say the same things I just said because I feel so repetitive but then I'm missing the points that I just said because it's not like I didn't say anything important in the last one but <sighs> here we go um yeah I just want to talk this whole this time I just want to talk about um the, the whole YouTube thing and getting gameplay scores and play gameplay style basically so a lot of people well first of all what people don't like seeing on YouTube is definitely UMP camping and high kill streaks so <sighs> it's those are what the, like the three things a lot of people do to be successful in this game um even if they're not camping, even if they're not doing all three at the same time, I'm just saying like, those are three of the like, the main things with this game are the kill streaks is which why people get high kills, camping is why people get high kills, and UMP. <laughs> but um, I don't know. To me, that's not really the case with the UMP. But I can understand the other two things. It's, but if you're one of the people who don't make the videos, if you don't make videos on YouTube, you just watch them. I want you to really start looking at videos differently and I'm going to tell you how to look at those videos. What you need to do is stop looking at them because they went like 30 and 3 and you're amazed by that in Team Deathmatch or whatever. Um, they went 30 and 3 and they camped the whole time and everything but you, you need to realize that it's a lot easier when you're camping and using higher kill streaks and things like that so when when people like me listen to like the community and what they don't want to see in YouTube videos because I have like I've studied I studied the, the whole YouTube uh, demographic I guess or whatever and they um they're not fans of what I just listed those things so I tried to avoid all of them um I posted like maybe one or two UMP videos. UMP is probably one of my favorite guns in this game just because I'm most comfortable with it. It's what I use since day one. <clears throat> but um... Yeah, I've been trying to do some more rush gameplays without that and you'll see, I mean, I got them on my computer. I'm posting them. The Domo... The Domination on v Vacant with the Vector. That was pretty rush. Rush-tastic. But um... But yeah, so I'm tr I'm trying to avoid things like um things that I know you guys don't want to see. So you have to respect if I don't get super high scores like anyone else. I'm not using the easy easy stuff because I was using easy stuff. If I was camping using UMP stopping power and I was I know I'm using UMP stopping power right here, but this is just, this is one kill I had to get him because he's far. Um, if I if I'm using like you won't be starting power and camping and using high kill streaks. Of course, I'm gonna get really high KD ratio and a lot of kills, but the gameplay is just not gonna be that interesting to watch. And I really don't care about KD ratio, cause I mean, even in my games, um, I I don't really care that much. Of course, I have to. I do have like some sort of limit where I don't want to like be going negative and post it because I ran around and didn't camp the whole time. I still want to do good, but um. I want to do good without camping and all the all the easy mode stuff, you know. So this game, I get like 11 deaths, and in team deathmatch, I guess that is kind of a lot. But the KD ratio is like over two. Um, and I don't really care if you don't say that's that good, but it it is good. I mean, if you're playing team deathmatch, the whole goal is to go positive. If you go positive one, then you did good. You did your job, and you did fine. So going going double 
positive or I don't know how you say it. when when you get a 2 KD ratio and um in team deathmatch that's really good because that means you did your job like plus someone else's job so you're really looking out for your team when you're going when you're going positive at all especially if you're double positive or whatever then you're you're definitely helping our team to a higher extent so look at and also there's my 11 deaths you gotta look at how I get them it's not like I'm always getting outplayed it's either like my spaz doesn't have enough, enough range like they got the M16 or some uh, some gay stuff happens I got new too they got set up with like all these claymores in one of her rooms and I've been using lower kill streaks now because people like seeing it and I like using low kill streaks too now just it's on the 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 higher kill streaks just cause you to camp. See, I just got all my kill streaks. Now I can just freaking run, or I did get all my kill streaks. So then after I got them, I had the freedom to just run around and be entertaining. But when, but when your highest kill, I mean, when your highest kill streak is freaking nuke, then you got to be camping like your whole goddamn game, or abusing your chopper gunner to no fucking end. But yeah, you know, I guess that's just how it is. If you, I'll post camp, camping gameplay, we get high scores, but I know not, not a lot of people liked it. I just wanted to do that just to see how people were going to react to it. Just to post, because I know a lot of people out there who don't post YouTube videos, they play like that. I mean, because no one's watching, you can do whatever you want. Before, I was recording my gameplays, and I I played how I want to. I used my UMP, and I would do my camping if I had to. I always had Pavlo on, because that is like my favorite kill streak. but I've been dropping that for you guys. Um, cause I did have to camp it out a little bit just to, just to get that final kill streak, which was the Pavlo. And then that thing would give me a shitload of kills, so, it wasn't like I was getting a million gun kills, but, um, look at that. That's like a 360 almost, that was kind of cool. But, you know, I'm not abusing anything in these gameplays really, and these are like, they're really good scores for the way I'm playing for YouTube YouTube acceptable, I guess. So just respect that. And when you see other people's gameplays, respect that they're not, if they're not abusing any kill streaks and stuff. I guess in COD 4 is easier because there's no real kill streaks to be abusing and no guns were too crazy except like the M16. But, you know, it's it's all whatever. I guess it's everyone's opinion. You can't please everyone, but I'm going to try to please them the most I can. So we'll see. I'll see you guys later, though. Peace.